Hi everybody, it is Saturday the 11th and it is 4.55ish in the morning. I've been up since 4.30 because of cats and one of them is probably going to jump up in my lap. But um, I need to go through zone 2 today which is my kitchen and then I need to clean the rest of the house and I need to finish the fall decoration that I started a week ago um, but I haven't gotten around to because you know I decided to go to Galveston for the weekend for Labor Day weekend and so I haven't actually cleaned the house and it's been a busy week so uh, sorry distracted by cats <laughs> but I am gonna go ahead and get started I've already cleaned out the sink in the kitchen for because there were food cans for the cats and uh, dishes that need to be put in the dishwasher I'm holding off on starting the dishwasher because I'm going I have some other dishes to throw in there but I am going to first start off with the scooping the litter box I won't share all of it but that's what I have to do because it is trash day today and I need to collect the trash so today I need to go through the refrigerator to make sure I get rid of stuff because I do smell something that doesn't smell quite quite right so I need to go through the refrigerator I need to clean it out my mom is also coming here to stay with me for a while she's having sciatic nerve problems so the chiropractor wants her to be here um, and go and see her every other day until this is repaired because my mom is going to be going on a long trip overseas in October, November, somewhere around there. So the chiropractor wants her to get that all fixed before she goes on her trip or else she's going to be very uncomfortable while she is on the trip. So we're going to go ahead and get started with the cleaning the litter box and we'll go through the house. I have laundry that I completed a couple days ago, but I haven't actually completed it because it's still sitting either in the basket, in the dryer, or on the couch and needs to be folded and then put away. And then we'll be done with laundry. But like I said, I am going to try to get this house cleaned up before my mom gets here today, which 11 noon. And we'll see how long it takes to actually do this because the kitchen is quite a lengthy process to clean, to do the deep cleaning because it's been a couple months since I actually got in the cabinets and cleaned out. So I need to actually go into the cabinets and see if there's anything I can declutter and get rid of while I'm also in there. So I hope everybody enjoys this and I will be back later through voiceovers and possibly face to face on the camera but I'm gonna go ahead and get started and I'm gonna listen to my Korean music and hopefully get in some mood. I... <laughs> this is the cat highway. <laughs> if no one under, uh, no, but yeah, they, it's the cat highway. They like to run through here. Anyways, I am listening to my Korean music so hopefully I can get in a little bit more of a cleaning motivation. And then I also need to make some coffee because it's 4.30 in the morning. I'm kind of tired if you can't tell. So let's get started. And it's hard to tell, but we have a little baby possum. I mean, not baby baby, but it's itty bitty possum out there. I'm getting a nice glare from inside the house because the light is on right here. But yes. I just fed the outside cats and baby possum arrived. And as mentioned before, I am cleaning out the litter box and filling this one up. And right after this, I will move into the one that is in my master bathroom and clean that out and fill it up with more litter. And then we'll move on into the kitchen again and clean the litter scoop. And then I will work on making my coffee and then we'll start cleaning out the fridge and pantry of all the things that need to go out in the trash and then we'll get going with the rest of the cleaning for the day
so good a day as any to start the rebuilding of life. The roads that lay open are many when the old one's gone on. And I am out of bags for my litter genie, so I am going to go ahead and clean this out and just continue to use the doggy poopy bags that I have a whole bunch of rolls of them. So we're just going to go ahead and clean this out with soap and water. And then I did spray it with rubbing alcohol to kind of disinfect it while it just sits in the pantry until I can use it. For my household cleaner or all-purpose cleaner that I will be using for today, because I'm getting ready for fall, I am going to go ahead and do my own all-purpose cleaner and I do enjoy the Mrs. Myers but the scents can be a little too overpowering I guess you could say so I am going to go ahead and I filled up a spray bottle with water and it's almost to the top but not enough and I do that first because if I put soap in first it bubbles and you know doesn't get the right stuff but I'm taking my regular dish soap and this happens to be Dawn and that's what I prefer because it is, it's what I've always used and I, I've tried other ones and they just don't seem to cut the grease like Dawn does. Not sponsored, it's just a personal, personal preference. But I'm just gonna do a couple squirts in here. Not too much because I don't want too much residue soap residue left on this on stuff and then I'm going to take essential oils and I have clove and cinnamon and I'm just gonna do a couple drops of both probably like five I like the clove scent better than the it's gonna be about 10 drops total this is only a 16 ounce bottle and my, the cap to my cinnamon essential oil has actually come off and I don't know how that happened, but. And then put the cap on and then I'll just do a slight agitation or in other words, shake the bottle to try to mix the the soap in to everything. And if you haven't changed your air filters out, change, go ahead and go and change them it's probably time. I actually change mine out every single month because of all the cats, the carpet, and it's just, this house has always been a dusty house. So I just go ahead and change them out monthly. I do get mine delivered to me through Second Nature. And again, not sponsored, it's just who I use. And I, since I have two air returns, they're two different sizes. And both of my filters are actually $40 total so it's like every month $40 and this shipping for it so it's I think $44 and change for me to actually get two filters when I would go to the store and I would not be able to find one or the other size air filter so but if you haven't changed your air filter go change them out we're moving into the time where we're going to start turning on heaters and it's probably best to start that up on your furnaces change them out and in the kitchen dining room area, I am starting off with the deep cleaning part and I am starting from the ceiling down and I went ahead and dusted the ceiling and I cleaned my windows and I went and wet my e-cloth mop and I am trying to get the walls. These ceilings are, it's a vaulted ceiling in here so it probably goes from eight feet to 12 to 14 feet probably right there at the top and then in the kitchen it's an eight foot tall ceiling in the kitchen but so I need a needed the tall uh, duster and uh, e-cloth mop and then I went ahead and moved on to the screen door and cleaned the inside of the screen door and the outside of the outside door and then I will 
turn it around and clean the door as well. And then I will move down to the wall where the e-cloth mop didn't quite get all the spots off the wall. So I will start actually spot cleaning the wall. I am going to start working on the patches and holes in the ceiling and walls uh, after the house got leveled. Not leveled, but um, it's actually the foundation was leveled. So right above in this corner, the the tape basically is pulling away from the crack for the ceiling and the wall. And there's some other things that need to be, like nail pops need to be, I need to put screws in the, where the nails are and just do some repairs. And then I need to start painting all the walls. So I'm basically you know, pre-prepping everything for to get prepared for that. This Wednesday will actually be five weeks since the house, the foundation was leveled. So I, they, they basically said wait five to six weeks to make sure that nothing else happens with the leveling. And then you can start going and uh, patching up all the cracks and everything that happened from the house getting leveled. So I am planning on to start doing that. And I'm gonna of course start in this corner right here and work on that because it's, I'm just going to take one wall, one room at a time because it's, I'm going to have to go through the entire house to do this. The entire house pretty much has to be painted again. So it's time that we do all of this. So from here, I'm going to mop the floor and then I am going to move on into the kitchen and start cleaning that. I did get an Instapot from my mom for my birthday. It was kind of a fluke she acts we don't know what happened but my little sister accidentally got two instapots and so my mom both of them were from my mom so she went ahead and took the extra one and brought it back and my mom wasn't going to use it so I said I would use it and so I will unpack that a little bit later it's just a regular uh, six cup instapot so six serving, something like that. So we're just gonna go ahead and move through the kitchen and clean off the cabinets. I did not actually clean inside the cabinets because I ran out of time with my mom coming in at around this time into the kitchen. I've been trying to get you out of my head. Oh yeah. But somehow I always seem to wake up in your bed.
Right now we're running around in circles But if you don't even want to try I need to know it Can we just open up? Cause I got to know If you feel the things I do Shut my feelings out You look at me like I'm different Still you stay cause you feel something real Get so lost in my moments Doesn't mean I don't need you I, 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 I fell in love with your colors They kind of tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose there's something different about us And the reason why we stay Stay We fly around like paper planes They never know where we will fall Nobody can see us Still they wanna tear us apart There's something different about the way we are Moving on to a few days later when I actually had a little bit more time to clean the rest of the house. So we're going to go ahead and start in the dining room and just do a quick wipe down of the windows and mirrors and then of course a wipe down of the coffee pot and the table and then a vacuum and then we'll move on into the family room and we'll do the same thing. Clean the windows and wipe down the surfaces and a small shot of my mom and a then we'll move into the TV room and it's the same process throughout the rest of the house and as the light startled our eyes we let go of disguise and now there's something in the air and a sparkly shimmer on our skin
you'll notice some slight changes in the furniture around the house and that is because my mom is here and she's having some back problems so she's having to sit in that straight back chair and um, some other things around the house so that's why I kind of move things around and just to accommodate her while she is trying to get her back fixed and then you'll also see well maybe not in her room but I've put a tabletop in there for my office so that way she can go in there and shut the door and work and do what she needs to do without being interrupted by the cats or me. So we're just gonna continue on with wiping down everything and then vacuuming and just continuing through the rest of the house. We were also getting prepared for the tropical storm Nicholas to come through. It actually turned into a hurricane during the night, but uh, we actually didn't have much issues with the tropical storm. It We had several branches that fell, but all of them were small branches and we're thankful that nothing else major happened to our house. And so, yeah, you'll see later, I think in my room that it's raining because that's when it started raining for when the first bands of the storm started to hit through here. Okay, you won't see the window as I <laughs> am in this room because I just didn't, I was trying to rush because when I was cleaning the hall bathroom, we kind of had a little power blip and the lights flickered a little bit. So I was trying to rush through the rest of the house and or my room and just to vacuum my mom's room. 
and that trying to get it done before we completely lost power which we never did lose power thankfully but it's still I was trying to get everything done and shut down all of my computers so that way I didn't have any power surges that destroyed computers so um, but it did start raining during here so that's why the lighting isn't the best and that's and also the power blips that we we were having so that's why I was trying to get it done as quickly as possible and this should be the end so thank you everybody for watching and I will be back next time with another video and I hope you enjoyed this if you did give it a thumbs up and subscribe thank you everybody feels like I can fly you can take me high I can see the sun staring at you when you make that smile